squat jump is a plyometric movement and the entire goal of doing a squat jump is to get as much power into each repetition as possible. Um, it, is, it surely shouldn't be used as a high repetition, um, tiresome kind of exercise. So it's not good to use in cardio circuits, it's not good to do for high repetitions. What we're trying to do with this exercise is get as much air as we can on every repetition. So make sure that you can do a normal body weight and weighted squat before you do these because you have to be super stable through the hips, knees, and ankles. And when you initially set up, you're going to be in your normal body weight squat position. So toes can be out slightly. If you're more comfortable, you can do toes forward. Just make sure that you're comfortable with landing that way um, before you continue on, okay? So feet are at least a shoulder width wide. You're going to send your hips down and back. Personally, I would swing the arms. If you're not going to swing the arms, just keep them out of your way. But you're going to try to triple extend. So extend through your hips, your knees, and your ankles all at the same time to get yourself up off of the floor. So we're not going to jump flat-footed and just land with our feet flat. We're going to try to extend all the way up. And as you come back down, you're trying to land the same way. So land with the toes extended, knees are extended, hips are extended. We're going to cushion the landing as we're coming back down. So we're doing the exact opposite as what we did on the way up, okay? So hands are going to swing down, hips are going back, knees are bent. We're going up as high as we can, and as we land, we're landing in that same athletic position, okay? So start off with a fewer number of repetitions. Pay close attention to your form and to how high you're getting. If you notice that you're getting fatigued, usually people will start getting fatigued after like five to seven repetitions if they're doing this all out. If you notice some fatigue, go ahead and cease the set before adding in more repetitions. Once again, adding more reps, you're still looking for quality form on every repetition.